I just wanted to thank you. For what? For not saying I told you so. I told you so. <clears throat> Do you mind if I ask, are you divorced? Yeah, as a matter of fact, I am. Why? Well, that's two things we have in common. What's the other one? Alex Gatch, too. There's a great bar about a block west. Um, I'm no good at directions. Uh, neat, please. It's not a last through any business we have together. Story of my life, women keep selling me short. What is it you want, Detective? I just wanted you to know that we can do it your way. But I just washed my hair. I mean the boy. You're right. He needs help. What about your eyewitness testimony? Well, I figure that'll come. In time. Well, let me spell it out for you. I want no part of it. Just what is your problem? What makes you think I have a problem? You got a chip on your shoulder the size of a redwood. Not for everyone. You're the only person I met lately who drinks alone. I drink a little too much, I admit it. I'm cutting down. And worst of all, cardinal sin, you don't like buckaroo burgers. Look, detective, why don't you just take your insults and leave? Those aren't insults, they're facts. And here's another one. You're a child psychologist who doesn't practice child psychology. Goodbye, detective. Why, Jackie? I don't owe you anything. Right. What do you owe Luke? What do I tell him when he asks me why you abandon him? What do I say? Right. That's my problem. You ever hear of Coolidge Elementary School? Playground. Plane crashed around the children. Not around them. On them. At recess. I worked for a year with the kids who survived. Kids who could still feel sticky blood. Kids who still could see their friends scattered on the asphalt. One little boy finally found his sister. Her body was caught in the chains of a swing set. No head. Just the body. Caught in the chains. My marriage was breaking up. I was distracted. I missed some signals. One of my sixth graders, a little girl, 12 years old, with brown hair and green eyes, killed herself. Kind of takes the fun out of it, you know. I lost everything. Weight. My husband. My mind. Never again. What about the others? What others? The others at Coolidge you worked with who didn't kill themselves. being kind about last night.
what happened with you and your wife? Cops start out like anyone else. I wanted two kids, picket fence. That was before the 104 homicides, the crack addicts, battered infants. Before I killed my first perpetrator. Blew his neck in two. I'm sorry, um... That's what happens pretty soon. You're chatting about it at lunch. My wife just couldn't take it anymore. So, on what a bliss. I started working 24 hours a day, groped every waitress on the sound, beat the teeth out of every suspected felon. And then one day I found out I was getting like them. Neanderthal. Well, your houseboat's hardly a cave. <laughs> Julia Child, do your kitchen? Oh, I started taking cooking lessons a few months ago. Really? Yeah. In the Indian art? Very chic. Chic? You don't think I'm becoming one of those candy pants yuppies? No. I think you're a man who got lost. Trying to find his way back to what's human. 